I'm applauding right now because we just recently saw that Jackson Blade actually showed some acting talents. He said that in Leesburg, Florida, he found it incredibly disrespectful that they didn't get Wild Man Rojas out of that ring so the people in Leesburg can see Jackson. Yeah, right. Jackson, wasn't it you that was in the ring with Boss Lady Volley in the beginning of the Leesburg show? And when she told you that I was still the number one contender, you freaked out, you got mad. Now why would a great champion do that? It's because he's scared. It's because he knows that his time as champion is running out. All these little things, these disqualifications, the rock hitting, it's only going to get you so far, Jackson. It's a matter of time that that title comes back to me. You know, I know what you're thinking. Because we both came from the cruiserweight division and we both won the title, you think you're as good as me. Jackson, I may have called you a poor man's version of ERA, but trust me, you're not that good. You haven't showed anybody anything, Jackson. You haven't garnered a damn bit of respect. But yeah, you're being cocky. You're throwing things out. Hey, I deserve respect. You deserve a swift kick to the ass. That's what you deserve. So January 9th, the mixed tag team match, you and Angelina against me and Raquel. Get ready. Because yeah, me and Raquel may have some issues, but we're going to put that to the side, Jackson. We have one common goal, and that's embarrassing the both of you and taking back what's mine. And that's the WXW World Heavyweight Championship. Jackson, that's not picture perfect. That is enough said.